Hi everyone, it's Tuesday. I had to think about that. It is Tuesday. Sorry. Keeper. Great job. Y'all were just talking about Thursday. Well, I also. Hi everyone, it's Tuesday, May 31st. I'm Jim Hummel with your KATC News Brief. LCG's Executive Chief of Staff is no longer on the job after about five months. LCG confirmed Mike Hicks' departure, but they won't release any other details. Hicks, a retired U.S. Army Colonel, was Mayor President Josh Guillory's commanding officer in the Army. He was brought in to oversee infrastructure projects, including for drainage. Recent drainage projects, though, have landed LCG in legal trouble. We do have a public records request pending for more information. The search is underway for two juveniles who escaped from the Acadiana Center for Youth in St. Martinville. According to the Office of Juvenile Justice, the escape happened yesterday afternoon. The juveniles are from Point Capi and Calcasieu Parishes. In St. Mary Parish, the Morgan City Council will soon appoint a new police chief. James Blair has officially retired. He's been chief since 2015, but with the department since 1985. And a fundraiser is happening Friday to benefit Black Cafe. The downtown business damaged after a fire in the building. A po' boy fundraiser is happening this Friday in downtown Lafayette from 10 until 2. Showing that we're supporting our local eatery right here, a, a business owner, and showing that the community wants them here. You know, no matter the little setback you had, the community needs them and the community appreciates them. So we're doing that to show appreciation. And let's get a check of the forecast. Rob, hurricane season starts tomorrow. Yeah, it sure does. And uh, the forecast is for another busy season, perhaps similar to 2020 or 2021. Doesn't mean we're going to see the same landfalls and intensities, but nonetheless, here are the normal numbers, 14, 7, and 3. Three major hurricanes, seven hurricanes, 14 tropical storms, and the Colorado State forecast well above that, and Noah's range as well. So be prepared. Nothing pending right now, but we are watching an area of disturbed weather down across the Caribbean. We'll talk more about that in the next update. Temperature wise in the mid 70s tonight. Tomorrow we'll see readings getting into the lower 90s. Widely scattered afternoon showers and thunder showers into the evening hours. Rain chances no higher than about 20 or 30 percent. That's the way it goes. It looks like most of the week. So temperatures tonight are only getting down into the mid 70s. So warm and humid tomorrow back up to 91 for a high with the risk of those afternoon showers and thunder showers again on a scattered basis typical garden variety summertime showers and thunderstorms and then as we move through the rest of the week we don't see much change going into the weekend still the risk of an afternoon storm but it could be even a little bit hotter during the day but maybe a little bit drier in the evening overall we're starting off june looking a lot like summer that's it for news and weather for now stay with ktc ktc.com and social media for the very latest